going on? You know what it is. MR2 boys, we're here. Finally. Look at this. Man, it feels like like old times again when I'm working on my own MR2. I'm here at Joseph's residence. If you guys didn't know, I used to own a couple MR2s and one of the OGs right here. Don't have them anymore. <laughs> Tells you something about them. But I still have the love for it and willing to work on it cosmetically. Look at these cracks, millions of cracks, dude. That's crazy. Imagine being on air and then still getting cracks in your bumper. <laughs> He's gonna come through, fix the long needed cracks on the bumper, on the side skirts. Don't know if they're ready for the wing yet, bro. I don't know if they're ready for the wing yet. It's gonna go, it's gonna go too hard. I don't, I don't know if they're ready for the wing yet. <laughs> this is far from more than team my boys. It's okay, this, man, I trust yeah, you. This is like a... <laughs> It's gonna end up crack cracking again in the future. <laughs> The face of disappointment. <laughs> I mean, I'm not saying I'm gonna do better, but. <laughs> hey, man. I think anything is better than this. Yeah, like, it'll be fresh. It'll be fresh water. There you go. <laughs> This is the cheaper route to go if you are looking to fill some holes on a trunk. Um, he has some crazy wing that's going on here, so we have to fill the 94 wing um, holes. So we just use fiberglass. Obviously, definitely grind it down, sand it down as best as you can, and then lay some fiberglass mesh on there. It's gonna do the best it can to hold, but really, you really wanna weld holes if you're gonna do something like this. But this should last a couple years. Um, and I was telling Joseph that body filler shrinks. So it's gonna eventually shrink to where you're probably gonna see the circle, but that's probably gonna be three, four years from now. But as far as what we have and no welder, this is the best it's gonna get for them. Oh, shit, that's freaking crazy. Yeah. Sick. Just clean it up. And then, and you have a couple dents. Mm -hmm. I don't know what happened, but they were like up dents. So I just hit them down and. Okay. Yeah, I don't know how the photos got there, to be honest with you. I've never even seen an MR2 with one. Like what made you, how do you find it? Like what made you like, you just type MR2 wings? And yeah, no, uh, I want the rear, the rear end for it. Front bumper and a, fr a front rear bumper and a wing. I wanted the rear bumper yeah. and I was like, oh, they have a wing too. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I just kind of just figured out where, where to get it. Biggest thing, if whenever you're sanding automotive things, my tip for you guys is if you're starting out, buy everything wood related. So this is a wood shop sander, and this is wood grade sandpaper. Take the machine, um, and that's usually what I do it. I don't know what this button does, it just vibrates when you turn it on, but that's what my dad taught me back in the day, so I'm just gonna send you. Yeah, and make sure you don't wear a respirator either. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what this button does. But <laughs> Got all my stuff getting painted around now. Was finished with the prepping work. I'm watching. I don't really know anything about this stuff. Me neither. <laughs> you hired the wrong person. We're both kind of just watching YouTube and going at it. But I'm making money from it. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> That's the only difference. <laughs> but as he's doing all that prep work, uh, I'm gonna try to figure out what's going on with this wiring, try to diagnose. The problem I'm having is the alternator is not charging the battery and I don't know from there. Because usually it's all the other way around where the alternators can't support it. But I've gone into several situations that the battery is just dead and it's running strictly off the alternator. Car is in pieces, as you can see at the moment. Not the prettiest, but it will be good soon. Yeah, probably exactly like, like that. But actually, it only goes on one way. Okay. Yeah, like there's no, uh, just like, this is good quality. The quality China. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we in there. So obviously you got the holes repaired, everything. Just gonna go and smack some primer. Um, 
how I usually like to do this is uh, what I learned in wood shop class is you're gonna just shake the can four or five times. Make sure you do that. And then you wanna spray when it's windy, okay? So when you're gonna go ahead and do this, and then it's gonna go all onto the camera. And that's exactly what you're looking for. That's how you get the best results. I gotta do double, so let this cure. Uh, sand this with 400 grit. I'm saying 400 grit. Prime it one more time, and then hit it with. Because it's white, you could just kind of stick with 600. You really won't see scratches like that. But any other color, you want to go up to 800. But there's no reason to not go up to 800 grit after a primer. So looking yeah. good so far, my friend. Yeah, repaired. I don't see. Look at that I ain't see. I can't even know where the holes are at no more. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, you'll see it when you put a clear coat. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> to just have to come out with the craziest build. Yeah. Especially with the clear tails on too. It's gonna be insane. Oh. Japan ain't even ready for this one. <laughs> no. <it's not. laughs> so we got the wing on. This video is probably won't be posted till after uh, the, the, the fitment, dude. It's just it lines up so well. Look at that. It, flo like, it flows. It flows. Yes, dude. They engineered this wing. Yeah. Perfect. The flow is just oh, the back. Yeah, end, I love how it covers it and too. And this is my favorite part, like this. Yeah. Because <laughs> yeah. you don't. Because MRT, I love is, man, you don't see anything yeah. like this. Yeah. Come on, man. Ah. Good shit, brother. Fire, bro. Yes, sir. <laughs> Don't hire me. Don't hire him. <laughs> Don't hire him, buddy. <laughs> We got the wing just uh, put on. Just see how it looks. It looks freaking amazing, man. Name a better rear end of MR2 than that, man. And also, I'm gonna ship out my clear tails today, so it's just game changer, bro. Fitment is on point. Uh, always trust parts in Japan. Fitment's always gonna be correct. So going back to the front bumper, gonna get it uh, prepped and skirts, and then go throw everything on the paint. But making good timing so far. Beautiful day. This is probably the hardest one of all of them because all the amount of body work needed. Oh, a battery. God damn it. But I'm recording much as I can. It's on lights. Yeah. She's cool. We're at the detail garage today. I'm here with Sam. Last time we went last month, uh, we only brought my or his car. But my car is finally here for once. <laughs> but parked way in the back because there is hella people. I didn't expect this many people to be here. I guess that one YouTuber, uh, that dude in blue or whatever is here, so. A sore. You know, no biggie, just another sore. Super clean. Angel's here. We are headed to, uh, right now we're headed to Springfest out of Virginia Beach Convention Center. It's been four years since I've been there. Last night I was up all night, uh, cracking the car, getting it ready for today's show. Well, the show's tomorrow, but bringing the car today. Uh, still have a lot to do, but the, a lot of the uh, guys are trying to meet up before, take some pictures and stuff, so I guess I'll just detail my car later. Interesting. Out here in Virginia Beach, Med Center. With Domi Dan. What's up, brother? <laughs> a little bit of a shoot before the show. Dan gave us some nice pics of the car in this nice little area. This space is crazy. Ran my first issue so far. Uh, you gotta roll in. When you, when you leave your car here, you gotta leave it a quarter tank and below. And I haven't driven the car in like two weeks now. And I forgot that I put a full tank in it. So I gotta either siphon some gas out or drive it. So at least it's so early I can figure that out. It's like about an hour and a half till actual rolling is supposed to be. So yeah, that should be fun. So I got this siphoning tool, Harbor Freight Special. 
we will see how this works. Got myself a jerry can, good old five gallon. Okay, well, it is now the right fuel level. We're all packed up again. I'm gonna take this stuff home actually and uh, get back to the show. I'm waiting for the long line. I am feeling sprinkled though. Are you we are all set up now. Uh, finally got a good spot. Spring Fest hooked it up with a pretty clutch spot right around the corner, so looks pretty good. Some more speed! Wait, let me see your post. Where's your car? <laughs> well, that is it for today. All set up and everything. We'll get it. We'll get all. Uh, we'll show it tomorrow with all the people here, pretty packed and stuff. But we are all set up now for Spring Springfest. See you guys tomorrow. Check out this thing, bro. This thing is insane. God damn. Oh, with the S15 seeds. With the Hitman. Damn. I love it. This thing is insane. This man already selling shirts. This show even opened yet. Yo, I can show me, show me what you got, man. Nah, what, we, man. what we got in here, bro? Hold on, hold on. We got a little something. Yes, sir. A little something, some something sauce, man. man. Like but we're pretty much all staged up for tonight. A little Frenchy. Come here, baby. Hello. Hello. <laughs> He's a talented boy. What is his name? Zeus. 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 That's an awesome name for him. High five. High five. High five. Oh. Show us a shirt. Show us a shirt. What you got? So I do. Um, Sir. I do two full. Damn, this car is this bro fun, dude. Vlogging? Yeah, bro. I'm a vlogger, bro. Oh my God. Jose. Jose, what's up, bro? Oh, what's up? Chilling, bro. Oh, I'm over there. On the other side. You having fun? Yeah, bro. Chilling. Who are you with? Just you? This thing is crazy. Oh, real right hand drive and everything. With the 20 valve. Damn, look at Christine. Yeah. 